for that. Look at this article. Hotels close to Darlington Raceway. So this is a really good article which fits this affiliate program. And then when we paste the affiliate program right here, it exactly what they're looking for, right? Refresh this. Look at the magic right here. And when you refresh, look at this. Uh, hotels close to Darlington Raceway. It is exactly what they're looking for. So Darlington is there and it will show all the close hotel to that area, okay? In this example right here, we will be using this expired domain called racedarlingtondragway.com which talks about, you know, the race that's going on in Darlington area. So look at this. It's got uh, DR25 and pretty good number of backlinks, which is, you know, not spammy. When we take a look at the backlink profile right here, you can see there are best link that actually talks about, uh, you know, related to the domain. So look at this one. This is a McLaren, which is, you know, uh, pretty much related to uh, the topic, the main topic right here, which is racing. And we scroll down right here. So it talks about, you know, Darlington Dragway, uh, everything and uh, everything about racing. Okay, these best links right here, uh, talking about uh, uh, sportsman spectacular presented by some, uh, you know, organization to this, you know, uh, Darlington Dragway uh, and all kinds of, you know, different backlinks that talks about, you know, very related to our domain right here. And here, what we're going to do is we will be using this keyword tool, uh, that IO, uh, where we can get free keywords. So here, earlier, I already did some work to, you know, capture some of the keywords that I wanted to add in order for me to rebuild that to me. I also gathered keywords from the people ask uh, about section in Google search. Okay, so you just uh, go to Google uh, search and type is Darlington Raceway and you will find, you know, specific, uh, you know, topics that you can create as articles and then, uh, you know, put that in your, put them in your new blood right here. And if we take a look at the uh, this domain right here, site that racedarlingtonway.com, it did not have any index. Uh, pages right now. So this means it's a opportunity for us to, you know, generate all this, all these, uh, you know, keywords that we gathered in Buck. So as you can see right here, we've gathered all the keywords that we will be using. So uh, for this one, we've got a keywords that we captured from Ahref related to Darlington Raceway. And we've got around, let's see, uh, 26 keywords from keyword that keyword tool that I owe. And we have you know, um, 54 keywords from Google people ask a uh, quest uh, section in Google search. So here we already set up the basic configuration of our WordPress, which is, uh, you know, we still a fresh copy of WordPress in that expired domain. And then here, first, we will need this plugin called WordPress REST API because I will be generating those articles. And later I will be showing you how we can exactly monetize that this, uh, these articles. Okay. So once the plugin is activated, we just need to quickly configure it. This is very simple. It takes 10 seconds. So just go to mini orange API right here, click this basic authentication and make sure this is tick. Uh, okay. You can click that again and click on next and then click on finish. And that's it. We've already configured our, uh, you know, REST API. Now going to uh, this one, article AI generator, and let's just test if our configuration is correct. So here, if you scroll down in general single article, you will see here test WordPress autopost. Okay. So we go to that page here. You can test the WP REST API configuration without spending credits. So as you can see here, we will be selecting Race Darlington website and this will auto populate the username and password of our editor role. So I added the sites earlier, uh, including the credentials. Now let's do the auto post. That's auto post. So as you can see right here, good job. You can auto post your WordPress. Now going to uh, the post section right here. So that means our configuration is working. So you can see uh, it sent the sample article from article AI generator. That means our configuration is correct. Now here we are ready to generate these articles. Okay. Let's just generate some few. Okay. So let's select this from keyword tool IO. Let's start from this 26 articles right here. I'm going to show you a strategy because here in article AI generator, we have this option to humanize the content, which gives us more opportunity to, you know, rank higher on Google since some of our contents won't have AI content, uh, although not hundred percent, but at least, um, uh, it, it will show Google that we made some work on, you know, uh, we put some efforts on humanizing our, some of the AI contents, which is so uh, at the moment we will choose uh, do generate bug articles. And later on, I will show you how you can do that uh, really quick because at the moment it's not available on the bug articles. That option right here is still not available. But what we're going to do is generate those bug, bug articles right here. As you can see, so uh doesn't matter if it's Claude or GPT. So let's choose an uh, maybe Claude. So, and then uh 2,500 words. So for now, I'm not going to uh, generate featured image. I'm going to do that later. And this one, I'm going to auto post that to my WordPress and set that to publish. And then here, select me racedarlingtondragway.com. And now let's generate that. 
So as you see right here, some of the articles have been completed. And if we take a look at one article right here, so let's take a look, at, let's go to the WordPress website and click refresh. So here you can see they got published right away. So if you take a look at one of the articles, so let's view this. So this is how far is Darlington Raceway from Myrtle Beach. So that's the article right here. So as you can see, it got uh, structured pretty well. At that and that meet decent number of words and written properly. We uh, take a look at the content right here. So we just copy a few paragraphs right here and paste that to a uh, AR detector tool. For example, this zero GPT, let's detect. You will see right here that it's got 100% AI content. Although it's not bad because Google won't punish you if it's all AI contents as long as you produce, you know, good quality articles. What we can do here is, you know, select some of the topics that you can monitor, I mean, humanize using this option right here. So you can see right here this topic, how far is Darlington right race raceway from Myrtle Beach? So here in the generated articles, you will see right here this how far is Darlington Raceway from Myrtle Beach. So we select that article right here. You see this option here. We can humanize humanize this article. Okay. And it will get auto post and it will be auto posted to our uh existing WordPress article. So, but first we need to click this humanize. So why we are doing this individually? Because it takes, you know, it costs some credits to do that. So we will just select uh, the best articles that we know we will be, we will rank on Google and then humanize them. Okay. For example, this one, let's humanize this, click this humanize. Okay. As you can see, article has been humanized. You may repost it using the form below. Okay. So you can see right here, uh, it re re rewrote the article right here and what you can do is repost that to your WordPress, okay? You can see right here the current ID in your WordPress website, which is right here. And you can just click this repost to update this particular post. So we will do that. So let's click on repost, okay? So it will update this ID right away without uh, us manually copying and pasting the new content. So let's just repost that. Okay, so as you can see, article has been reposted. Please check the status below. So it got reposted successfully. Now, going back to the same article right here, let's refresh the page. Okay, so this is the new version of the humanized content. Now, let's take a look how much article contents have been reduced. Okay, so again, we grab some content right here, okay, maybe until here, and go back to zero GPT, paste that, and let's detect the, if there are still human contents. If there's still AI contents, I mean. So as you can see, it dramatically reduced the AI content right here. Although it still has remaining, but that's fine because uh, no one is writing perfectly without the help of AI right now. No one will be marker enough to write the full content, just their own version. They always need to be, uh, uh, they always need assistance nowadays uh, using Claude or any other AI tools. But the fact that it dramatically reduced the AI content, so also uh, reduce the risk of getting penalized by Google. Also, we will apply the same approach to some of the articles that already been generated here. Okay, so as you can see, you've got indication which articles have been, uh, you know, humanized or not so we've humanized one of the articles which is that uh this one as you can see it marked as yes so let's grab some more good keywords right here for example where is the best place to sit uh darlington raceway so this is also a good uh you know candidate to humanize and also who built darlington raceway or why is darlington raceway called the lady black things like that okay so you can do that to some of your articles okay humanizing them now using this booking.com affiliate partner which i already showed in my previous video so we can create a new affiliate account here for our darlington raceway website so we just need to please click this add a new affiliate so it's very easy to get approval from booking.com affiliate center as long as you have you know existing website which you can show them when you applied for an affiliate program then uh, most probably you'll get approval okay so here we will name our new affiliate as the name of our website, which is, we just need to copy the URL and then paste it right here and the uh, URL.com and then add this as a, uh, once you have added that, make sure you just uh, keep in mind this uh, affiliate number right here, 2420337, because we will use that right here. So you go to marketplace and click this all products. And here, scroll down to this My Map Widget. Okay, so click that. So now here we will create a map widget. So we will create a map close to Darlington Raceway. Okay, so which I'm gonna show you. And it really fits to our website that articles we are doing right now. So when you are here in this area, so you just need to type in Darlington. So it's better if there is, you know, actually a Darlington Raceway um, 
Darlington Raceway. Uh, look at this. This exactly what we're looking for. Raceway in Darlington, okay, in South Carolina. So that's where Dar Darlington Raceway located, okay. Well, so you can see here there are hotels that showing close to Darlington uh, Race at the spot right here, which is you know the Darlington um, Raceway. Okay, so this is a good opportunity for us to to those people who are reading our articles and interested to go to Darlington Raceway because they can actually see exactly the close hotel that they can book and you know they can already preview the. Uh, prices of the hotels and can easily see how you know how far the hotel will be um to darlington raceway okay. uh, you know remember your affiliate id which is this one the 242 2420337 so that that's our darlington uh new darlington account there is some bug here because it's not showing the actual name of the affiliate which is fine because uh and we verified that it's this is the actual one and once you Click this create, you will see here, it created this script, which we can, you know, uh, easily grab, okay? And paste that directly in our uh, WordPress website. So we copy this, so you got this, uh, before that, look at this article, Hotels Close to Darlington Raceway. So this is a really good article, which fits this affiliate program. And then when we paste the affiliate program right here, it exactly what they're looking for, right? Hotels Close to Darlington, and we are pasting the uh, map we get. We which actually shows the closest hotel to Darlington Raceway. So let's do that, adds inserter. So install this adds inserter right here. So once it's activated, you can go here to settings and then add inserter. And then here in any block right here, you can just simply paste the code that you copied from booking.com, okay? Now here, we will put that before content. I think that's the best place in our article to put, okay? And it will appear to each and every post you have. As you can see, post is selected. So you just save that. And when you refresh this, look at the magic right here. And when you refresh, look at this, uh, hotels close to Darlington Raceway. It is exactly what they're looking for. So Darlington is there and it will show all the close hotel to that area. Okay. And you know, the best way that we, you can get traffic out of this, if you are able to rank this particular keyword, which is, you know, very possible right now. Okay. So look at these, uh, these are our articles, which is, you know, a pretty good opportunity to rank on Google, it has a higher chance because the way we structure it, it's not spammy. Again, although it's AI generated, but it's not spammy. You can actually humanize this by the technique, the strategy I showed you using this humanize, uh, you know, for example, this uh, waves that hotel ho close. So let's do that. Hotels close to Darlington Raceway, which is right here. You can view this article right here and humanize this, uh, you know, our article uh, version, uh, AI content version of the article, and you can easily humanize that and repost that to your uh, existing website. So existing article, replace the existing article with this humanized content. So you have a better chance of, you know, ranking on Google. We'll just quickly add theme, which is our favorite me. It's very easy to configure. So let's do that very quickly. Install that. Now here, go to customize. And you'll see right here, these are all our, you know, our articles uh, in our homepage. We can uh, simplify the structure uh, and just go to plug here. Just show two articles at a time. And then I don't want to show the dates and the author. So you can configure that here in the post meta. Don't show the this tree comments. Don't show it as well. So you can just, you know, simply have the title and the, you know, the content of your article. And then going inside the article right here. So you can see the map is loading. So you can remove any unnecessary pages right here, any unnecessary section, which is this one. So let's remove this right like that to make it a, a bit you know, prettier. We will add some uh, logo here, which you can easily configure using header and then go to header main, see this uh, change logo, and then select this uh, second tab and we will add our logo right here. Okay, our nice logo is now set up and we can just configure uh, this uh, by just adding some border rib. Okay, we put five and we change that to red so it it matches our logo right there and we increase the size of, uh, you know, this uh, row a little bit and, uh, you know, we can remove the menu because later we will change that. So let's read the menu right here. We call it tap menu. Click on next. So later we will add items in the menu, okay? I'll configure that later. So once you visit this site, it will look a bit pretty in your... So I think uh, that's about it, guys. So if you have any question or if you want to clarify things, uh, you can leave a comment below. And uh, if you like this video and you learned something from it, uh, please do like. Thank you.